Hello everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich. Welcome back to Let's Play Rogue Galaxy. Whoa! Oh hey, Death Crows! Okay. Ugh, I missed I missed that one. Wow. Good. Okay. That's the cool. End of that. We got relaxing aroma. I like it. It makes me feel somehow relaxed. Whew. Whew. Oh, we need to head this way. Angela's bar. Yeah, Angela's bar. Oh, it's right over here. So, first off, boom. Another Stella Crystal. They're super important. Perfect heal. This thing. Pretty rough and tumble town. I didn't realize we were that close. This is going to become my practice file now, because this is right about where I'm at in my practice file. So, time to go into Angela's bar. Give me another. Come on, that's enough, Digo. Oh, drop it, would you? Why can't I drink as much as I want? <sighs> Come on, cut it out. You never used to be like this. What happened to the old Digo, the heroic soldier? Look at you. You're just a shell of your former self. And look at me. Silly enough to fall in love with such a miserable man. He's a dog. Oh, this again. I'm tired of talking about the past. Diego. Oh, I'm sorry I didn't see you there. Something to drink? This way. Oh, it's that old guy. <laughs> what was that for? All I did was just ask around about the tablet. Oh, uh, sorry about that. All this secretive sniffing around. Guess you still have no idea. Gail. <laughs> Keep sneaking around. And you'll be putting your life at stake, old man. No, I, I was just... <laughs> Haven't seen you before. <clears throat> Something's fishy. Who are these guys? They are my customers, Gail. And while they're in my bar, you don't get to hassle them. Huh. Look, this is a very important time for our town. Don't do anything that would make anyone suspicious. That goes for you, too, Angela. <sighs> Got a problem with that? No? Good. Just remember, defy Zack's Morarty, and you won't survive for very long in this town. So don't try anything stupid. Got that, Angela? And Digo, Got your tail between your legs as usual. All that money you scraped up in the mines? Or is that just to buy yourself some drinks? You definitely are a loser, Digo. Pathetic. Move. <laughs> Whoa! 
is great! Why, it's fate that has brought us together! Say, big fella, you look like you work at the mine. Is there a secret entrance to that place? Would you be so kind as to show me? Oh. No thanks. I'm not getting involved. Oh, come on. Please. Don't make me tell you again. I won't do it. Oh, -ho. I see how it is. You're afraid of that fella. You look pretty tough, but you're really just a wuss, aren't you? What? Whoa, wait a second. Don't get mad. This has been a dream of mine. They found an ancient tablet in a mine on this planet. Its archaeological value is absolutely mind-boggling. I can't die until I've gazed upon that tablet and unlocked its secrets. Come on, can't you help an old archaeologist dream come true? A dream come true? So that's your dream, huh? You bet! Tell me, you got money, old man? <laughs> oh, oh, that's rich. Oh, my. Have faith, good fellow. Money is no object for me. Then you're not an archaeologist. <laughs> hey, why don't we go with them, Jester? Oh, so you two want to help as well? Sure. Can we come along? Are you serious? Of course! Of course! All right, then it's settled. The Burton Caravan is off to find the Great Tablet! Then we better leave soon. First, you need an ID card. The item shop downtown should have some black market cards. Gale's got his eye on you, old man. You stay here. We'll get the card for you. Alright! That is the eighth member of our group. I see. Yes, all right. But you know, I will get a little lonely. Oh, don't worry. I'll be happy to keep you company. Ah, yes? That sounds marvelous. Ah, haven't had a drink with a beautiful woman in quite some time. Very well, good luck out there, troops. Oh, and feel free to take your time. Huh? All right. Now, we're outside. You need to do something right away if you're following along with us. Go back in the bar. If you don't get this right now, you're gonna have to wait on it. And we want this. All right, so Digo is not an NPC. Digo has a revelation chart. He's a member of our crew. I wonder how our first mate, Cat, is going to feel about that. We have no... Oh, we could give him breakthrough. It's kind of a shame that that's all we can give him. That's a really cool... The trumpet shape mark looks, looks awesome. Alright. So we have the star key. We have Digo. It's time to leave. That guy can stay in the box. So, Rosa it is. We haven't come back here in a while. Now you can't go in and talk to Diego. I tried my practice file. That door is locked. But, we can go back by the church. And there's a treasure chest we can open. We're doing well. Let's hurry. And I like Diego. I or uh, Digo. I'm a sucker for a um, miserable drunken. Um, yeah. This is great, by the way. Let's get this fast. This is what you get. 
Yeah, yeah watching how quickly we we go through stuff uh, on this planet. But wait a minute, there is a chest. What am I looking at here? Oh yeah. We actually have to go... Don't fall behind, okay? Down this way. This is the first star key chest we, we ran into. We will have random encounters everywhere we go. That's fine. We got ally hammer fists! A weapon for a character who's not in our party. But that's okay. That's all right. I'll take you on. Let's go. Yep, it's that quick. Those guys were no challenge at all. But we'll take the items. All this running reminds me of military drills. Oh, I don't need to go up there. Digo, come on, man. I'll jump right over you, because I'm that good. Okay, we only need the earth key for that, but it didn't make sense to come back here and then come back here again. There were some there were two earth key chests on Jerica as well that we skipped. For the same reason. We have to go back to Jerica anyway. Alright, spaceport it is. That is not the one we want. It's over here. Hope it all goes well. Two myriad branches. Let's keep this up. This is the best approach. Good. I like Kimmy. He's very positive. Like... And he's a cool character. I mean, again, I'm a sucker for, like, drunken, washed-up guys. And he's cool-looking. He's, like, just... Oh, man. He looks so tough. Alright, to Jerica we go. Jerica has several. Alright, so first off... We can teleport... to the Star God God's Altar. And there's uh, a couple chests there that I believe require the Earth Key. Don't fall behind, okay? And I believe they're up on the altar. We're gonna run this video long until we've collected all of the chests. Oh, they're not up on the altar. My mistake. That's right. All this running reminds me of military drills. Two antidotes. Maybe these didn't require a special key. But they would have required coming back. The plot line took us out of this area, so... I suppose I can't work like I used to. And magic lipstick. We need that for Digo because he's not pretty enough. Right. <laughs> anyway. 
That seems like an item that would only ever be used for Kasala. She's the only even slightly girly girl we've got. All right. Sherio's hut. Let's keep this pace up. The only real problem with this is the walking. At least we've we've activated every teleporter we can. But the walking and climbing stairs, because we have twos in huts here that both require stair climbing. Okay, wanderer's coat. A uh, new. You never know what'll happen. Um. It's a new coat for, uh, what's his name? The guy who's betraying us. I forgot his name. We haven't, we haven't, we haven't played with him in so long. I mean, since we were here on Jerica. I think there's alternate outfits for almost everybody, so... Okay. Now, is it Dario's hut is the other one? Filio's hut. We need to find. There we go. And then we have three on Zerard, and we're gonna be done with this video Don't and caught up with okay? my practice file. So we'll get it done in a little over 20 minutes, probably. Military grade battery, not a revelation item, probably a factory item. I needed some exercise anyway. Hey. And Kasala needed some exercise anyway. So, you know. Alright. Okay, we're heading for Zerard. Because why not? So these are pretty straightforward. There's one in the spaceport. And this will catch us up. We, the only chest I think we've seen that we can't open at this point Pretty is enough. the We're chest inside the professor's lab. And that one requires the sun key or something. Else. Like the star key, the sun key. The sun is a star. Jump over you, Hannibal. Three firestones. A new item. I don't know if they're a revelation item, or uh, I think they're actually probably a factory item or a factory material. Oh, look at them sending down the landing dock for us. By the way, there's our ship. That's what it looks like. That's really cool. All right. So inside the Galaxy Corporation, and uh. Up by the bounty desk and then also there's one next to the starship factory and that's where we're gonna save and stop the video I'm hoping I can avoid talking to Mio by just going around this way good I can great no automatic Mio cutscenes all 
Alright, ho ho bird feather. Hooray, hooray. And then finally, the last item is going to be the first captain sock we can get. Which is awesome, because it's a revelation item. The shame is, we, we, we're only going to get one from the chest. And we, we've either got to use it on our main character or on Digo. I'm probably going to use it on Digo, considering I don't have the other item that would unlock one of his basic abilities. So it should be right over here. You can see it from here. Let's keep this up. This is the best approach. Captain Sock it is. Let's check out our revelation chart. With the Captain Sock, we can give Digo what? Wonder Howl. And we could give our main character what with that? Whirlwind level 2. Whirlwind level... Oh, but what we can do is Illusion Sword level 2. Which my practice file got a long time ago. We could also do Fire Resistance level 2. But I think... Oh, Zegrim's his name. Ooh, Star Charm level 2 if we had that stupid... Oh, man. Oh, we could get Deadly Stench! Oh, that's so tempting. Tones of Purity level 2. Yeah. Man, so much good potential stuff. What is that? A mellow banana! I didn't even know. <laughs> like, okay. Well, anyway. We're gonna hold off. I don't think we're gonna give her deadly stench, although that's hilarious. We are gonna give Digo, Digo Wonder Howl, though, because I believe that that pumps everybody up. And it's also gonna allow us to give him... Oh, we could give him Evil Resistance level 2. We can give him Burning Strike level 1. So, let's see what Wonder Howl does. Vicious Howl creates a sonic wave. It attacks all enemies. That's what's important. And yeah, Illusion Sword level 2. Which is cool. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go back and we're going to save. And when we come back, we I will have practiced ahead of this. And, jeez, I'm seriously like a month and a half of videos for this game. I'm so hooked on it. So when we come back, more of this. You guys take care. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it because I know you don't have to do it. Bye, everybody.